They've gotten the ball stuck. <laughs> Ryan Bundy not showing the good hops. There we go. If that's We've how you care of it. spend your time, well, that's how you spend a timeout, getting the ball stuck. No, I'm just kidding. I, I took those off for the second half. <laughs> Allison, turn around and wave. <laughs> Hi, everybody. I don't know which hey, going. you know, we didn't talk about this, Alex. Uh, you're, you're graduating here in about a week, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, this is, this is the most likely the final shoot that I will be a part of here in my four years of CU TV. It's quite, it's, it's an experience to say the least. Yes. I, I've, you know, it's been great. Alex, I remember you and I came in at the same time in the fall of 2007. Mm -hmm. Rode in the back of our old production truck to Charleroi for high school football <laughs> that first shoot. And oh yeah. It's Charleroi been, Manesson. It's been great getting to know you over the last four years, obviously. We're gonna miss you, but let's be honest, you're going on to bigger and brighter things, my friend. Most likely, uh, most no, you, likely you are. Out There's to no the most likely. <laughs> Well, I have to get an actual job first. This man's going to be a superstar <laughs> one day, ladies and gentlemen. Alex Kunkel, look it up. I'm sure you'll find him online soon. AlexKunkel.com. <laughs> I didn't want to mention I didn't know if you wanted that out, but the guy <laughs> kind of does have his own website, ladies and gentlemen. Check that out. If you want to know, AlexKunkel.com, your source for all things Alex Kunkel related. Unfortunately, the AlexKunkel.com graphic, apparently we must have lost that in translation. Well, that's all right. They know where to find me. We still got a little bit over a minute left here. It looks like the Wolverines going to try to pass this ball around. And just a tough break there. Inbound comes to Swede. He's going to try to dunk it. He misses this 360 spinorama. Had the look. Just couldn't get the finish. You know, I don't want to say that Rashad Hatton probably could hit that dunk, but Rashad Hatton could probably hit that dunk. <laughs> I also think that John Tyler could probably I hit that dunk. I think Rashad Atten's going to try and one-up him. And oh. no. Would someone get the lids off these rims, please? This That's is getting the ridiculous. That's third missed dunk in that, this quarter. Salou, three ball, no good. Rebounded by Foster ahead to Batch. We're going to set something up here. There, there it goes. Go. That is Wes Lyons. Oh, I got a little bit nervous there when Batch threw that one up. I knew it was yeah. a pass, but I didn't know if it was going to have enough height on it to really get up there. It's under 30 seconds left. Rashad Hatton trying to school Lima Swede and then loses it to Wes Lyons. Here we go, Wes Lyons. There it is. The reverse dunk. And it's 181. You know, he, he did a very nice job there, at, you know, making it look like he got a little more height than he did because he raised up the knees. So to throw that one down. Five seconds left. Money's going to set this one up. He's going to take it from half, half court. court. Nope, way off. 181, a very impressive showing by both squads. What a great game and what a great cause this all was for. As we've mentioned, all proceeds going to charity. Give it up for both of these teams, Alex. Yeah, this was an excellent performance by both teams. Very competitive, very entertaining, and I think, I think, Allison, you could say that the fans are going to be happy after they leave this one. Absolutely, I mean... These players really put on a show, especially offensively, hitting threes, hitting some dunks. Great job by both teams. And as you see the final congratulations there between the Steelers and the Wolverines. A great game by both teams. Kayla Smith, her final game in Hamer Hall, most likely. As well as Rashad Hatton and Anthony Vaughn. And as the Steelers leave the court, I believe, as you see, that is Harris there congratulating. Let's take a look at Rashad Hatton once again, just throwing it down like nobody's business. That's something we got to see a lot of during the basketball season, Andy. He has a great job throwing up to himself, then going the other way. Nice job by Sweet throwing that one behind the back. Nice flush, and I mentioned there, raising up the legs. Bending the knees right there, making it look like he get a little more air than he did, making it that much more exciting for the fans. I mean, what can you say? It's exactly what I think we all expected it to be. I didn't expect Charlie Patch to be hitting as many threes <laughs> as he did for four quarters. A great game. Footballers do hit 100 points. Very impressive showing by the Washington County Special Olympic Wolverines, scoring 81. Very solid game. Thank you all for dealing with me. <laughs> that was a little bit different today, but hey, you got to have some fun. Alex, it's been great. Why don't you take us away? For everyone here on the CU TV crew this evening, for Allison Steinheiser and Andrew Walter, my name is Alex Kunkel. Your final score is 
Footballers 100, Vulcans 81. For the final time, have a good night, everybody. Good night.